What's up guys, Alex here with another video and I wanted to show you guys this really cool audio plugin that I found uh, while messing around in another program. Now this plugin is called UWashock, as you can tell by the name here, and I found it in a music making program, FL Studio, and basically what it does is um, it'll maximize the frequencies of your audio. So basically what it does is it makes your audio sound louder and better without distorting any of the frequencies in the audio. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys an example. So here there's an audio sample on the timeline. I'm going to go ahead and play it without any effects on it. Sony Vegas is a video editing program. So as you can hear, it's kind of dull. It doesn't sound very rich. Now I'm going to go ahead and enable the plugin. And this is what it should sound like with the effect applied onto the audio. Sony Vegas is a video editing program. So as you can tell, uh, by the effect it doesn't distort the audio and you get a really a much cleaner and richer sound to the audio so here's how you download it go to the website in the link I put in the description and it'll take you to the site of the download and once you download it you want to go ahead right click run as administrator and you're going to want to install it as a VST plugin and click next and here's where you install the plugin. This is really important. So you go to Browse. You go to your local disk underneath your computer, uh, your main hard drive, basically. And you want to go all the way down to uh, Program Files x86. So if you have a 64-bit computer, you don't want to go into the regular Program Files. Uh, you want to go into the uh, Program Files x86, which is basically um, the 32-bit compatibility uh, folder for 64-bit computers. So underneath the program files x86, I want to go all the way down to a folder called VST plugins. And VST plugins folder should automatically be there since you installed Sony Vegas and there's some Sony Vegas audio plugins installed into this folder. So go ahead and click on VST plugins, click OK, click install. Mm -hmm. And once you install it, everything should be fine. You see, it restarts Sony Vegas. So since I already have it installed, I'm gonna go ahead and ignore this. All right. Now I'm gonna go ahead and go back into Sony Vegas, and here's how you uh, install the final steps of the program. So you go to Options, go to Preferences, and then you want to go to your Audio or VST Effects. My bad and search for the default VST search folder which should be the folder where you installed the VST plugin you should see this here and make sure it's checked and hit apply and then OK and then you'll find it automatically in the list of effects for your audio so there's really not much to play around with the program or the plugin uh, basically this controls your uh, levels how much you want to maximize your audio and the A, B, C, and D are basically presets uh, for the plugin. So if you want to change your frequency a certain way, uh, you can play around with any of these four presets. So I hope you guys found this video helpful. Um, this plugin is really useful if you want to make your audio sound better. Um, I use it in all my commentaries, and it really makes all the audio sound very rich and clean. So if you guys like this tutorial, please give it a like, comment on it, and I'll see you guys next time.